In Creo 10.0, Creo Flow Analysis has added some new result-based improvements. Prior to Creo 10, when you saved the project, the results were stored as well, but any of your customized results were not stored and you had to recreate these scenes. Now in Creo 10.0, all of your customized results are saved within the project. Here I'm going to take this simple valve into Creo Flow Analysis, create the fluid domain, specify materials and physics, and then generate the mesh. All this is done in real time to show you the speed in which Creo Flow Analysis works. After the mesh is created, we will assign our two boundary conditions for the inlet and the outlet, setting this up in a very simple way for water to flow through this valve. Let's input some numbers for the inlet and release our streamlines. Next, we will run this simulation and see our real-time painting, which is a big benefit of Creo Flow Analysis. Let's change the results to look at velocities. And next, let's add some animation to the streamlines and take a look at some of these new options. First, you can change the release mode from the default of continuous to a single release mode. Next, as you can see, you can now have an indicator along the streamline of either an arrow or a sphere. Each of these options have modifiable, modifiable parameters to change the size. Creo Flow Analysis now has a simulation scene which captures your result settings and your view orientation. Let's capture one for the streamlines and just call it scene one. Next, let's make a couple more scenes. We'll now make a cross-section view and change the orientation. After it's complete, let's capture another simulation scene called scene two. And lastly, let's add an ISO surface result, change the orientation, and then capture one last simulation scene called scene three. Creo Flow Analysis now can capture your streamline animation as an animated GIF file. Under the project menu, you will find this option. Now I'm going back to the simulation scenes. Let's see how easy it is to apply the scene for the three that we captured. Here is one, two, and three. Each time changing orientation and result settings. When I save my project, all of my result customizations will be stored within the project file. These result options in Creo Flow Analysis add more efficiency to PTC's embedded CFD solution.